Hey there friends, thanks for checking in at 5150 Rifles SHOT Show 2023. And this is Keith, owner, CEO of 5150. And he has created a design that nobody has seen before. So I had to show you guys, feature it here. Thanks for coming on the thanks channel, I'm happy to have. I, I checked him out last year, but he's even improved his craft. He's going to talk more about it. Thanks. This is the Evolve platform by 5150. So what we've done is we've uh, done the first major redesign of the AR since 1956. And what we've done first and foremost is eliminate the pivot pin, take down pin system of the gun. There's a little detent right here at the back. You simply push the button. You're gonna throw the lever 180 degrees. You're gonna roll your, your upper to 90 and it lifts right off. Okay, so there are no takedown pins. You don't have to push anything through. Nope. It literally takes Maybe three, 10 three. to 15 seconds, you can swap your upper. Yeah, that's that's pretty cool. Yeah. And, and what's your response? What has been the response so far at SHOT? Why didn't I think of that sooner? <laughs> <laughs> Did you patent it? Yes, we have patented it. Okay. So for example, though, you take if you hold on to that, my partner offhand here, Magic of Media, yeah. well, now I can hook this on. I go close quarters. That is so cool. And once again, under 10 seconds. Under 10 seconds. I'll hand that back off. And now we're back outside and shooting distance. Very nice, very nice. Let's take a look at some of the additional features because I, I like what I see, I like what I saw yesterday. Mm -hmm. I wanna show these guys what you, what you offer. Okay, well first and foremost, we took an inch out of the magwell. A lot of people notice we have a lot different shape to our magwell. Let's get a little closer okay. to the camera. So if you see there, we took an inch out of the magwell, flared it, and actually put a real deep chamfer on it. And the reason we did this is because it's gonna give you a, a much lock, shorter lockup time on your mags. So I mean, it is just right in and out. And you don't have to jam it in there because every time I put a mag in, I, I wanna seat it, I have to you know, yep. hit it. Nope, no, it's literally just in. See, now that's something, that, you better be careful. I hope you're patting that too because somebody's gonna steal that. <laughs> well, you never know what they're gonna try to take. But at the end of the day, we just wanted to make the best AR possible that 90% of the world could afford, they would never need to upgrade. Our guns come, oh, by the way, made with pride in America. There's nothing on here from foreign soil at all. God bless you. Okay, full length Arca Swiss rail. I think we're the first in the industry to release that as a standard on all of our guns nice. with integral 45 degree offsets. So for example, we have this other gun right here that's all set up, okay? When you roll off your primary optic onto your secondary, it's actually already at the correct pupil height as if it was mounted to the top Picatinny. So you're not actually searching for your red dot. It's already right there. We know seconds save lives and make a difference to our law enforcement and military. So we wanted to make sure we really got this right. But even if you guys are out pig hunting or something like that and you miss and that pig charges you, you can roll onto your secondary and pop it when it gets up close. Let's get a close up of that because there's there are no additional mounts or anything. Uh, that's the mount right there. That is our Okay, our mount. so that's yeah. your mount. Yep. It chips with the gun and that is your secondary red dot right. optic. Which this is that the mount is off the gun. So cool. Yep. So we're used to attaching something M lock. Right. And this is already set up for that. Right. And so everything about the gun we've tried to make uh, less intimidating, so even newer shooters. So me personally, I hate timing M-locks. I think they're a pain. Um, so this top rail, we took the M-lock slots out and we actually just tapped it. So if you want to add another section of Picatinny, it literally just goes on with simple screws, torque it down, you're good to go, and you got a full length uh, Picatinny rail on top. We, but we don't stop there. We call the platform Evolve for a reason. Um, we run a single feed ramp not a dual feed ramp. So you're gonna have less chances of uh, misfeeds or jams. Nice. It's a guaranteed sub m -way barrel, manufactured in Florida by a veteran-owned barrel company, Hitman Industries. We run a two pound hyperfire trigger standard, unless it's for the LE or government model, then it's gonna be a four and a half pound. They can't have fun toys like a two pound trigger. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hey, can I show that? Yeah. I checked this out yesterday. Nice wide trigger guard. Yep. I like that. And then it's a very, very short, and light trigger pull. Very nice. And some of those additional features are super cool. You have a rail up here. Tell me about the brake. So this is one of our two brakes. This one's uh, gonna be more of our precision longer barrel brake, so you're not dusting up anything like that. It's uh, two, two ports on each side at a rear uh, 60 degree angle, so it's pushing the blast this way, but you still have an 11 degree target crown to push that sonic boom away from you. Yeah. Okay. Um, the other brake is gonna be right here. This is our X brake. Uh, so it's going to be an X pattern. It throws, so it's not going to fog your glass. Extremely loud. It is damn near punishingly loud. Yeah. But that's because it's that efficient. 
Um, we have one of our young, junior three gunners running this thing, and every time he gets off the range, people go, what the hell are you running? And he goes, it's like the best break I could find. And this was actually a- And this is it, huh? Yeah, this is it. We call it the X-Break. Um, the other thing that's really cool, we design all of our guns to be suppressor optimized. So out of the box, they're gonna have an adjustable gas system with a suppressor optimized charging handle, directs all the gases out of the ejection port with a full auto bolt carrier and a captured buffer system. Like I said, we wanted to make sure our gun out of the box never needed to be upgraded. If you needed to shoot targets, put dinner on the table or defend your family, it's gonna do the job and do it better than everybody else's. You've said that before. <laughs> Yeah, you said before, I guarantee it. But it sounded really cool, and, and I, I believe you. I've known you for a couple years now, mm -hmm. and, and he doesn't play around. He's got some beautiful rifles here. And then what's the color of this Cerakote? That that actually is KG Gun Coat, and that is called Fool's Chocolate. That is a proprietary color for 5150. Wow, that is really sharp. So you put an optic on here, you can put a 45-degree uh, optic on here if you want, yep. but you're all set. You're you, you get you get you, you get your mag and you're you're firing all day long. Well, if you're gonna do that, then you need to make sure that you talk to our sister company. Oh, because they make hands down the best optic mounts and sights you're ever gonna see. Um, and if you are gonna truly use this gun to its fullest potential, you want to make sure you have products that can back up it as well as my gun. Which I would tell you that you need to talk to David from Optimum Parts. Before right. we do that, though, I want to talk about this extended mag release that that's pretty cool because there there have been times when yeah. you know I've, where, where is it yeah here it's a big old button drop that mag also new this year oh wait there's more we got the AKAR so if you like AK-47s but want one that's accurate here you go all American made all the same stuff as our typically evolve but it, it takes your AK mags which I'm having trouble with so no problem Right there, available in two calibers, 5.56, five, of course, and 7.62 by 3.9. Just like our other guns, available in seven different calibers. It, no matter what you need, we've got it for you. MSRP. MSRP is 1776. Easy number to remember. Same as the Evolve. Same as the Evolve 15. Here we have David with Optimum Parts to share what he has in terms of optics. So we have a scope mount that we've developed. Um, with a different clamping system. Our clamping system does not clamp through the Picatinny rail, it clamps over the Picatinny rail. Once it's clamped and torqued in place, it wedges itself in. To get it out, you can't, you don't take the screw out, you actually back it out and then slam it to release the, the wedging system. Uh, we've had it shot on a 375 shy tack at a thousand yards uh, and maintained zero without the screws in it, just to test the wedging effect. Can we get a close-up on that sure. so we can show, back it up just a little bit. There we go. Nice. All right. So it's an easier on and off process. It's an easier on and off process and it will hold. It also comes with an effective bubble mount so you can level your gun before you shoot. Especially great for ELR type shooting. Yeah, nice. Nice product. Thank you. I, I've never seen anything like it. We also make iron sights has the same setup to clamp to your rail uh, but our mount our mount has a double uh, tombstone style holding system so it clicks into place and hands down the best on the market to hold if you run into a door What's that jam cost? a set of them is $230 MSRP gotcha okay all right awesome anything else that is it all right hey 5150 rifles. Optimum parts. Company. Optimum parts. <laughs> just if you look, this guy. Just if you look at the partnership, it's Op 51. I saw that. And we will have uh, a website that's op51.net that will combine, it. combine everything. Gotcha. All right. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate the thumbs up button. Thanks for watching, and you guys be safe.